I realized we have reached here just in time to see JetBlue take off. Just a little sound of JetBlue for all of you all to hear how it sounds taking off. Yes, and we are here after a long time. Well, technically, I'm always there. I just never go on that side. So this day was Sunday and I was like, why not? Let's show them how it looks like now versus before. And there you have it. And I decided to let you see this house up close and personal. Remember, it was being built time I came here and now it has people living in it and it's like an apartment now this hill this is the hill that was so difficult to climb after coming from there but we're gonna hit all the way at the bottom and then we're gonna go on the right side there's another road there where y'all will see where i went underneath the road where there's a bridge Let's go guys. I gotta say that part wasn't fun for me to do because I felt like the zoom was going to be really bad. But it wasn't that bad. And over here, oh, the distance here where you could see the mortuary, you could see the place of resting for our dearly departed souls. And you could also see the airport. From an eye's view, you could see the airport. You could see all the way by the beach, Sandy Beach. You could see in Viewfort, you could see the stretch going to come to Cedar Heights. And you could even see traffic moving on the streets there. You could see a lot, but the view over there is breathtaking. And you could see the solar panels that they put there. Even though my hands wasn't steady, and I had my PVC tripod, but I wanted to catch a glimpse of everywhere. So I did a circle. So here you have it on this side. So guys, I'll just let you all enjoy the view. Now here, I stop to smell the, the flowers. Or the, it's not a flower, it's the bush. Because I thought it was something that I could make some tea out of. It looks different. And the sun is really hitting my face, but there is shade. So I walk and I was chatting with my sister. You could see her shadow in the background and hair guys hair is where I went underneath the road that looks like a little tunnel and I did a video about it so you could check it out like I said before I'll be putting the links to these two videos or maybe one video so that you can see now as of before Here we're closer now to the most difficult road I've ever climbed on and it's short. The very first one I said that was difficult, it was difficult but this one was really short and when I first climbed on this hill I thought if you miss any fall I think it would be over for you. It was very difficult, it looks really short but don't underestimate it. As we go up further into this road you will get to see the red roof house and I always show you whenever I go for my come with me walks.
come to where I climb up this little hill. Can you remember? For those who've been there with me for a long time, I climb up this little hill and I jump down, almost losing my balance when young was there with me. And I said, do it for the vine, do it for the vine. Yes, that's exactly this area, this particular area. The hill looks lower now. And this road will take you to the rock, the rock road where they used to have a lot of rocks and fire stones and that will lead you to the old reservoir road. This is what we call a bond. That's what is left when they're marking your boundary so you can know from what angle to what angle that you have to fence for your property. Wheelers, we rest here for a while, but knowing me, I decided to take a little walk higher up and there I came up upon these stones, these colorful stones. Well, they are colorful, but it has its own color. So I just will say that it's a colorful light green to deep green, you know, stones. They remind me of gemstones or if I'm correct or correct me if I'm wrong and there is where I found it. I touched one and they all just came crumbling down so this is a huge chunk of them. Here is what I call the red roof house. I don't know why I call it that guys but yes and you know red is my favorite color so maybe it's that this downstairs looks like an office and finally we're going to the original road which is the rough road but hanging on to it this very road that i'm walking on used to have a lot of rocks and firestones that's what i call them firestone because they smell like match when it's not apart from that i guess that's that's it you can see the view and the video ends in a while so guys don't forget to watch all the video keep on supporting and see you all guys on the next one